Hello, my name is Razvan and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I want to show you the second part of uh, this 3D origami mushroom tutorial. I will show you how to make the foot of the mushroom and the support. A very nice and small uh, model. And uh, also I want to show you a little bit the model that uh, I'm working. A little uh, one of them. 3D origami flower. It is not uh, quite finished, but uh, I hope uh, in a week to complete the model. I must make a support. There is a problem with uh, 3D origami flowers. They are very heavy and uh, it is quite difficult to make a vase and a support for them. I will try something uh, very simple. Also, I'm working on a 3D origami small base. It is made from a small pieces. It is quite difficult to make a small vase from large pieces. And uh, I'm working also on some uh, simple paper flower for this vase. I, I am quite new in this uh, paper flower department but I hope I will uh, finish a model in a couple of days. Let's uh, start the tutorial. Now we finish the upper part. We squeeze a little bit and this is our mushroom. Now for the lower part, for the foot of the mushroom, we connect pieces like this, white pieces. And we will make a small 3D origami open base. And uh, we connect pieces like this until we have uh, 8 pieces in the first row seven pieces in the second and six pieces in the third. Now we have six, two more. Do not forget to glue. I will glue after I stop the camera it is more more easy for me now we have eight pieces in the first row seven in the second and six pieces in the third next uh, we will close the base and we put one piece in the second row and two pieces in the third row and now we have an eight uh, pieces open base. Open base means that we do not have here an inverted row. And uh, now we put uh, rows above. We will have in total 20 rows. Now we have three and we put 17 more. And do not forget, if you put a row in this direction, the next row put the pieces in the other direction like this. Continue like this until we have in total 20 rows. We finish uh, this, we have 20 rows, 8 pieces each row. If you can, uh, you can try to make a little thinner, but uh, this uh, is easier to make. If you put only 7 pieces, it is very difficult to maintain these uh, 20 rows. 
Okay, now we have eight pieces in each row and uh, 20 rows. And we will give a nice curve. Very slow, we curve a little bit. And we glue these two together like this. Glue very well. For the support we will uh, use large pieces and we start with uh, dark brown and uh, we connect again pieces, we make a 3D origami base, 10 uh, pieces in the first row, 9 in the second and 8 pieces in the third. forget to glue Now we have uh, 10 pieces in the first row, 9 in the second and 8 in the third and we close the base, we put uh, 1 piece in the second row and 2 pieces in the third row like this. And we have an open base. We push a little bit like this. Next we will double the number of pieces in a row. We have uh, 10 pieces and we increase to 20. And we put one piece here between the two from the previous row and then two light brown above and then repeat increase again and two pieces above and uh, we repeat this until we complete the entire row Complete the entire row. I complete the entire row and uh, now we have uh, 20 pieces in this last row. Next we put uh, another light brown row like this.
next we increase again now we have 20 pieces and we increase to 30 and in the same way we put one piece here between the pieces from the previous row and then we put two above then we put one normal one normal means that only put one piece in two edges from the previous row and then inc again increase one normal and increase again normal and increase complete the entire row after this uh, pattern sorry do not forget to glue complete the row I finish uh, this uh, last row and now we have uh, 30 pieces in the last row and then we put one uh, green row like this complete the entire row and uh, now we put the last green row a complete uh, row like this finish the row now I complete this and we will push a little bit here to increase the space for our mushroom. This is the mushroom glue. And now we put and then push. We will glue this together. I uh, finish glue to glue all parts together and now my 3D origami mushroom is uh, finished. It is a very nice model and it is not uh, difficult to make. I hope you enjoy this. Uh, if you like my videos please uh, subscribe, uh, make comments and uh, share my videos. This is all for today, have a nice day.